Hey Warriors, how you guys doing, man? Today we're gonna talk about how to get that negative mindset just, you know, in control. Because, uh, you know, the thing is that you're never gonna get rid of those negative thoughts. You know, they're gonna come and go, but there's a lot of ways to curb that, to, uh, you know, kick it out of your fucking, at that, at that moment and have it in control, you know? And one of the ways that I came to realize and found out that it was, uh, you know, you know, selfishness, you know? A lot of us, you know, we always worry about what's going on with us, what's happening to us, you know, you know, that, that you're the only one that have it hard and uh, nobody else does. And, you know, as soon as you get all your, you know, your negative uh, thoughts, you know, of yourself, just remove them out of the way and, um, you know, start helping others, you're going to get uh, further in life. You're going to get all your wants and needs out of your life because uh, you're so focused on helping others that you forget about what what's going on with you you forget about what what you're going through and that's one of the ways that you know you're going to be able to uh help yourself in that manner because you know other than that you're just so much into yourself that you just uh self-destruct so the only way that you're going to get that you know in control is always focusing on how to help others how to serve people if you wake up with the purpose of like man how what could i do today to help others what could i do to help my loved ones you know, there's a lot of people that are going through a harder situation, you know, than you are. And once you realize that, you're going to see how little, how insignificant your problems are. Because a lot of us, we just uh, create bigger problems than what they really are. But like I said, you know, it always goes back to, oh, because it's happening to me and, you know, you know nobody else is going through it. All those problems that we have, all that um, negative thoughts that we have, everybody's going through them. But the only difference is that people, you know, victimize and there's some people that are going to do something about it. You know, there's a lot of people that are going to let that consume uh, their energy. They're going to walk around all day with negative uh, thoughts, negative energy, and uh, you're just going to be pushing that uh, to others. You know, so here, the point here is, like I said, you know, once you start helping others, serving others, and realizing that your problems ain't shit, you know, um, you're going to think different, you know, you're going to, like I said, uh, the only reason why we always fucking get in our own way, because we're the only ones that get in our own way. And that shit's just the level that you're at. When you're getting on your own way, you know, it's a, it's a problem because you, you still have a long ways to go. I realized that because, you know, back then, you know, everything was about me. Everything was, you know, oh man, what, what what's going on with you? What's, you know, what's your problem? You know, and when you really uh, think about it and sit and realize that, you know, those problems are like the, the you don't even want to bring them up. You're embarrassed to bring them up because they're so fucking little, so minor, you know, that you're like, damn, am I really complaining about this? Like everybody forgets about how far they come and, and, and they're always just pushing to the next move, you know, or, or the, the next want, the next desire, you know, instead of, you know, being, um, uh, content and, and being uh, grateful of the position you're in or where you're at in life, you know, and that's one of the problems that people have is not being, uh, you know, focusing on, on what they don't have instead of what they have at the moment. And, and you know, we got to we got to just get that shit in control and realize that we're the ones that are doing that to ourselves. So we get in our own way most of the time. It's not other people, you know, so you got to get ready for that. That's next level when you got to. Um, you know, deal with people that are trying to put you down or uh, stop you from your goals. You know, that that right there is like out of your control. But a lot of shit is under our control. And that's what we're doing to ourselves. We're getting on our own way. We, there's so much choices in life that we just get confused. You know, we get confused because we have so many options. And that's the problem. When you have so many options, you just want to pick and choose and not stay in this, you know, this spot long enough because you know like i said you get impatient it doesn't work so you think that the best uh move the best move is the next move and uh it really ain't you know you're just you're just lost you're just all over the place and that's one of the that's one of the reasons why nobody gets nowhere you know i came to realize that you know i always was like all over the place you know i started something and it didn't work out and i just moved to the next and, and i didn't give it enough time you know, that, that's the problem with everybody is the time. Everybody wants it, you know, overnight, and it's not going to happen overnight. 
You know, you gotta, that's why all this is earned. Fitness is earned. Weight loss journey is earned. It's the process of understanding that, man, it took you this long to get like this. Now it's going to take you this long to get like that. And, and that's what people don't understand, you know? So you got to understand the level that you're in and uh, you just got to put, you got to enjoy the process because when you're enjoying the process and you're not so focused on the result, then, uh, you know, the results are going to come, you know? When you're so focused in, on, on the moment, uh, on the process, on, on the feeling, and uh, making yourself proud every day by doing what you got to do, man, next thing you know, it's like the, the results are there. You don't even notice. People start noticing. People start telling you, oh, man, you look great. Oh, man, what are you doing? You know, fuck, man, you change. You look different. They're the ones that are going to tell you. You know, you're just too, you know, too impatient and rushing the process. And you, you don't even enjoy, you don't enjoy the journey. The thing here is about learning and enjoying the journey as you go and, and, and make yourself proud every day. So if you just wake up and make yourself proud every day, you know, you're going to get further in life. So like I said, one of the key factors here that helped me is just getting my feelings, my wants out of the way and focusing on others. Because when I'm focused helping others, my clients or anybody that I get in the, in, in, uh, in the phone with and uh, listen to a lot of people's problems, real problems, you know, it makes, fuck, man, it makes me, uh, uh, my problems fucking insignificant, uh, useless for me to even be thinking about that. Like a, like a reality check, a slap in the face. So you guys got to realize what you guys are really uh, uh, letting yourselves uh, be defeated by. By, by whatever you're telling yourself that it's, you know, it's so grand, it's, it's so hard, it's so difficult that you can't move on. You know, really think about what, what you're complaining about because that's what, one of the problems with uh, society out here. Everybody wants to crack. Everybody's so cupcake and, and soft that once something gets difficult, which, you know, ain't really shit, you know, you stop on your goals. You stop on your vision. You know, letting junk food, letting... Uh, pleasure stop you from that ultimate vision that you have that's fucking weakness right there because that's something that's you know it's it's choice it's a choice it's something that's not even that you know it's i can't even fathom to think that you know that that shit was stopping me before you know something that once i came to sit down and realize like man it was just weakness weakness that i was doing that to myself because it wasn't others you a lot of, of us we do that to our own selves we self-destruct. So make sure you check that, you know, make sure you check each box and make sure that you're not the only one that's holding yourself back. Just run it.